yoga, more than just exercise. Have you ever wondered what yoga is and why it is so popular and beneficial? Do you think yoga is just a form of exercise or is it something more? If you are curious about these questions, then you are in the right place. Welcome to Science Daily, the channel where we explore the science behind culture. In today's video, we are going to discover what yoga is, apart from exercise, and how it can improve your health, happiness, and well-being. Let's get started. The word yoga comes from the Sanskrit root yuj, which means to yoke, unite, or join. Yoga is a discipline that aims to harmonize the body, mind, and spirit, and to connect the individual self with the universal self. Yoga is not just a physical activity, but also a philosophy, a science, and an art that has been practiced for thousands of years in India and other parts of the world. Yoga has many aspects and dimensions, such as physical, mental, emotional, and spiritual. The physical aspect of yoga involves the practice of postures, or asanas, that stretch, strengthen, and balance the body. The mental aspect of yoga involves the practice of concentration, or dharana, that focuses the mind on a single point, such as the breath, a sound, or an image. The emotional aspect of yoga involves the practice of meditation, or dhyana, that calms the emotions and cultivates a state of awareness and inner peace. The spiritual aspect of yoga involves the practice of devotion, or bhakti, that expresses love and gratitude to a higher power, such as God, nature, or the self. There are different types and styles of yoga, each with its own characteristics, benefits, and challenges. Some of the most common and popular ones are Hatha Yoga. This is the most basic and widely practiced form of yoga that focuses on the physical postures and breathing exercises. Hatha Yoga is suitable for beginners, as it introduces the fundamentals of yoga and prepares the body and mind for deeper practices. Hatha Yoga can improve flexibility, strength, posture, and relaxation. Vinyasa Yoga. This is a dynamic and flowing form of yoga that links the postures with the breath, creating a continuous movement. Vinyasa Yoga is suitable for intermediate and advanced practitioners, as it requires stamina, coordination, and balance. Vinyasa Yoga can increase cardiovascular fitness, metabolism, and energy. Bikram Yoga. This is a hot and humid form of yoga that consists of 26 postures and two breathing exercises, performed in a room heated to 40 degrees Celsius and 40% humidity. Bikram Yoga is suitable for all levels of practitioners, as it follows a fixed sequence and pace. Bikram Yoga can detoxify the body, improve circulation, and reduce stress. Ashtanga Yoga. This is a rigorous and challenging form of yoga that follows a set of six series of postures, each increasing in difficulty and intensity. Ashtanga yoga is suitable for experienced and dedicated practitioners, as it requires discipline, endurance, and commitment. Ashtanga yoga can enhance strength, flexibility, and concentration. These are just some of the examples of what yoga is, apart from exercise. There are many more, such as Iyengar yoga, Kundalini yoga, Yin yoga, and others. Each of these types and styles of yoga has its own advantages and disadvantages, and it is up to you to find the one that suits your needs, preferences, and goals. And that concludes our video for today. We hope you enjoyed this exploration of what yoga is, apart from exercise, and learned something new and interesting. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. Also, don't forget to leave a comment below and share your thoughts and opinions on this topic. We would love to hear from you. Thank you for watching and see you next time on Science Deli.